Ride along as I fly from the Tri-Cities Airport at Pasco, Washington, west to nearby Yakima. Pasco is in south-central Washington state along the Columbia River. Yakima lies at the eastern edge of the Cascade Mountains. It's the hub of an agricultural area known for hops and a range of fruits. Although the skies were clear, I filed and flew an IFR flight plan, including an RNAV GPS approach. I wanted to practice using the newest avionics in the Bonanza, including the GFC 600 autopilot and its VNAV capability. Based on the winds and runway likely to be in use at Yakima, I plan to fly the RNAV GPS X-ray runway 27 approach. It offers LPB minimums identical to those on the ILS. Given the choice, I usually fly an RNAV procedure. I don't have to change navigation sources or worry about aberrations sometimes encountered when flying an ILS. I filed from Pasco direct to SUNED, an initial fix for the approach. From SUNED, the procedure takes you through a series of fixes, with step-downs along the way to RACOP, the final approach fix. As you can see in the profile view for this approach, you must cross UPSI between 4,700 and 6,000 feet, and then you can descend to cross ZUDAS at 3,900 before descending to 2,900 to intercept the LPV glide path at RACOP. You then follow the glide path to the decision altitude. Notice that the chart includes two lines of LPV minimums. The first, marked with an asterisk, is 1,268 feet, 200 feet above the runway. The second DA, without an associated mark, is 1,668 feet, 400 feet higher, and the required visibility jumps to one and a quarter miles. What's going on? The answer is in a fine print note at the top of the chart, if you use FAA charts. It explains that to use the lower DA during a missed approach, you must be able to meet a climb gradient of at least 300 feet per nautical mile until you reach 3,700 feet. The tricky bit is determining the rate of climb in feet per minute that your airplane will be capable of if you have to fly the missed approach, given the current density altitude. And you must determine how the wind will affect your ground speed. That calculation involves the performance charts from the handbook for the airplane you fly and applying some basic math or using a table that the FAA publishes on the back inside cover of the TPP. I won't go into the details here. That explanation is for another video. Suffice it to say that my A36 was capable of meeting the 300 foot per nautical mile gradient required to use the lowest LPV DA. Departing PASCO is straightforward. The airport has a single standard instrument departure, the Tri-City 7, which is basically a climb on a heading assigned by ATC with vectors to your cleared route. The top altitude is 10,000 feet. Here's how I loaded the flight plan in the GTN 750XI. I started with the departure procedure using runway 21 right. Then I added SUNED and the destination, Yakima. Finally, I loaded the RNAV X-ray runway 27 approach, beginning at SUNED. Now let's hop into the cockpit as I request, copy, and read back my IFR clearance. Clearance, Bonanza 1546 Foxtrot, straight to copy IFR to Yakima. Bonanza 1546 Foxtrot, Tri-Cities Clearance, clear to the Yakima Airport via the Tri-Cities 7 departure. Then as filed, I will maintain 6,000, departure frequency 128.75, squawk 4652. 1546 Foxtrot, clear to Yakima, Tri-Cities 7 as filed, 6,000, 12875, and 4652. Bonanza 46 Foxtrot, read back, right? Tri-City Scrown, Bonanza 1546, Fox Drugs, it's Solanair, uh, IFR, and we have information, uh, Romeo. Bonanza 1546, Fox Drugs, Tri-City Scrown, runway 21 right, taxi via Echo Alpha 5, hold short, runway 21 left. 21 right, Echo Alpha 5, hold short, 21 left, Bonanza 46, Fox Drugs. Okay, so that's coming out of here. It's a right turn on Echo. Clear left and right. Brakes are working. 
139, Julia Delta, fly straight out runway 21 left, clear for takeoff. City is ground from RF 281. RF 281, Chiray City is ground, cross runway 306. Yeah, Land uh, 46 Fox Track, cross runway 21 left. Cross 21 left, 46 Fox We're going to do a quick run up over there on the other side. Roger. Tower Bonanza 1546 Fox Track, ready to depart 21 right IFR. Bonanza 1546 Fox Track, Tri City Tower, fly runway heading, runway 21 right, clear for takeoff. Runway heading, 21 right, clear for takeoff, 46 Fox Track. Mirage 04 Charlie, traffic taking the runway for departure is a Bonanza. Clear for Charlie, Roger. Skag 9 Joe Delta, resume on navigation, contact departure, have a good day. Resume no nav, uh, contact departure, 9 Joe Delta, thank you. Runway checks, here we go, runway 21. Runway heading, 6000. Power is set, fuel flow is good, airspeed's alive. Gauges are good. Up we go. Taxi light off, gear up. Prop to 25. Skyhawk 77 Hotel, traffic departing runway 21 right is a bonanza. Roger, looking. 77 Hotel. Bonanza 46 Fox Track, contact departure. Good day. Thanks for your help today, 46 Fox Track. Departure Bonanza 1546 Fox Trot 1100 climbing 6000. Bonanza 1546 Fox Trot showing up departure radar contact. Sky Knight are leaving uniform. That traffic's now at your 2 o'clock 4 miles northwest bound altitude indicates 2500. Bonanza 46 Fox Trot turn right direct soon. Right turn direct soon at 46 Fox Trot. Jump plane 96 Delta, jump plane 96 Delta, frequency change. Jump plane 96 Delta, or correction, jump plane 96 Delta, roger. Attention all aircraft, parachute jumping operations within the vicinity across the airport are beginning now, 11500 in the surface. Number 2405 Golf, Chinook approach, Tri Cities altimeter 3006, runway 290, you set Pendleton, advise when you have the Pendleton weather. Leveling 6,000. Chinook approach, Cessna 739 or Whiskey, Mike, uh, would like to cancel flight fall and head back to Richland. We have the weather. Skyhawk 9 or Whiskey, Mike, Roger. Uh, radar service terminated. Squawk VFR, change to advisory frequency approved. All right, we'll get ourselves organized here. We are now 16 miles from Suned. Let's see if we can pick up the ATIS. Yeah, from the tower information, Julia. Oh, no, zero three five right. five three Zulu. Wind three two zero at four. Weather is better than five thousand and five. Temperature two three dew point niner. Altimeter three zero zero seven. Runway two seven visual approach in use. Restricted area six seven one four is not active. Advise on initial contact. You have Juliet. We have Juliet. Skylane zero five Golf. Uh, uh, quick question: After Pendleton, are you planning on departing and going direct? Uh, yeah, so away? we are in GPS nav mode, going to Suned, which is a fix to start this approach. We're going to request the R nav right. X-ray runway two seven starting there, um, and then um, that's at six thousand uh, at or above uh, four thousand seven hundred at Suned. Then it's forty seven hundred on down to. Uh, Oopsie, then Zudak at 39, and then uh, Rykov, the final approach fix of 2,900, which is what we're... 05 Golf, radar service terminated, contact we'll set once we set 
Get LPB minimums at 1268 because we do have the client capability. Visibility though is good, winds are good. If we did have to go miss, it's a climb straight ahead 2100 and then a right turn uh, back towards uh, the fix to hold. But we won't be doing that when we get there. The, the taxi route's kind of complicated. Over to McAllister. Not the altimeters and the AWOS and the ATIS. We don't need any light protection, uh, ice protection. The lights are on except the taxi light. We're on the left tank. We're going to stay there. Minimums are set. 1,268. And we'll fly this approach. We'll use the VNAV feature if they clear us. Commander Julius Delta, traffic 10 o'clock, 1 0 miles, the, northeast uh, sound, altitude indicates 5,500. And then it'll be. Okay, if you look at the track, it's right now. 18, 17, 18 inches, manifold pressure, 2500 RPM, approach flaps, gear down at glide path intercept all the way to the runway at about 110 knots. We'll be turning off to the uh, right, probably on Bravo. Back there, Julie Delta, maintain VFR turn right, heading 350. Loop our way around. Turn right, heading 350, Julia Delta. Seven miles from the Suned. Bonanza 46 Fox Rider's information, Juliet at Yakima requesting the RNAV X ray 27. Bonanza 46 Fox Rider, Roger. Bonanza 46 Fox Rider, contact Chinook approach 123.8, and they'll give you the approach instructions. 123.8, thanks for your help, 46 Fox Rider. Chinook approach, Bonanza 1546 Fox Rider, level 6000, we have Juliet. And the 1546 Foxtrot Shinnick approach, roger, and would you like that approach to be as soon as? Affirmative, 46 Foxtrot. And the 46 Foxtrot, roger, cross soon at or above 4,700, cleared RNAV X-ray runway 27 approach. Okay, soon at or above 6,000, cleared RNAV X-ray 27, Bonanza 46 Foxtrot. And the 1546 Foxtrot, cross soon at or above 4,700, cleared X-ray runway 27 approach. Okay, so at about 4,700 cleared RNAV X-ray runway 27, Bonanza 46 Foxtrot. Okay, we're at 6,000, we'll go ahead and cross that down to 4,700 once we get to Sunet. Go ahead and get the tower frequency up 3525. miles to lose about 1,200 feet. See if it works here. We can arm approach mode as well. Here's our top of descent. And 46 Foxtrot, verify you have information, Juliet. We do have Juliet, 46 Foxtrot. Back on tower, we'll put the VOR up here. Bit of wind out there, 25 knots actually, off our left wing. Top of descent's coming up. Got two months. Vertical track's active, we're gonna go ahead and bring the power back. got a long ways to go. So we'll leave the flaps up for now. The path is now active. Down we come. After, oopsie, it's down to 3,900. Got a long way on that leg, though. 
Make a correction, we're only three miles. We got a turn coming up. Here's the airport. 3900 at, correction, 4700 at, let's see, down to 39 and two and a half miles at Sudek. Then we have a long leg, seven miles to the final approach fix. Okay, now we're continuing to 29 and we've got seven miles. Slow down once we get uh, leveled off here a little bit. LPV is enunciated. Six miles to Raycob, the final approach fix. We cross that at 2900. And then down the glide path, approach mode is armed. Bonanza 46 Foxtrot, contact Akima Tower 133.25. Over to Tower, thanks for your help, 46 Foxtrot. Morning, Akima Tower, Bonanza 1546 Foxtrot, four miles from breakup. Bonanza 1546 Foxtrot, Yakima Tower, good morning. Report 3 mile final runway 27. Report 3 mile final 27, 46 Foxtrot. Next year can come back smoothly to Rich. Put 21 9 up here. Right pass starting to come down. Stand by on the gear and then the flaps. Speed checks. Glide path capture, gear coming down, taxi light on. Three Red tower, so go, go, four, four, two, four, go, ten east, landing with Juliet. Number 442 Echo Yakima Tower Report, 3 mile final runway 27, then number 2 behind a uh, uh, King Air about 4 miles ahead of you. Okay, we'll, we'll report 3 mile final, 442 Echo. We are in the groove. About 1,000 to go. Our missed altitude is 2,100. Prop into 25, quick go around or miss. And tower Bonanza 1546 Foxtrot, 3 mile final runway 27. Bonanza 1546 Foxtrot, runway 27, wind 3503, clear to land. Clear to land, runway 27, Bonanza 46 Foxtrot. November 4, 2 echo correction on that preceding traffic, it's a Bonanza and it's still about 4 miles ahead of you, no factor. Fuck that, and uh, we're about. Two miles east of the river. November 4-2, Echo, Roger. Runway 27, wind 3503, three. cleared to land, disregard the three mile call. Cleared to land on 27, 443. Green, green. Mixtures rich, props at 25. Approach flaps. About 500 to go. Autopilot coming off. Flight director coming off. Yaw dampers off. Power. On my visual glide path. Full flaps. Speed checks. And uh, Yakima Tower, Century 620, frequency change, please enable. Century 80 November, frequency change approved. Good day. Thank you, everybody. Props full forward, three green. 
on speed, on center line, slightly above glide path, on the visual glide path. We're continuing to the landing, three green. Light crosswind from the right. Oh, well, there we go. Alpha 2, right on Alpha, and uh, cross runway 2 2 at Alpha, left at the end to McAllister's. Okay, right on Alpha, cross uh, 2 2 on Alpha, and then right at the end to McAllister, 4 6 Foxtrot. End of number 4 6 Foxtrot will be uh, left at the end. Left at the end, 4 6 Foxtrot, thanks. Flaps, cow flaps, and landing strobes. Okay. Okay, we are on Alpha. We are cleared to cross 2-2 two -two on Alpha. Here comes the runway. Strobes coming on. Clear left and right. Left all the way to the end. Let me turn. November 4-2 Echo, say parking location. We're going to Adele's. Number 4 to Echo, turn right on Alpha, left on Bravo to Odell's. Right on Alpha, left Bravo to Odell's, 4 to Echo. 